making sure everything else isn't blocking anything okay we should be good to go start the episode the darkest moment in any hero's tale usually comes just when things are finally falling into place. Our unlikely heroes have discovered the unfinished, top secret project of the doomed Atlas Corporation. Uh, the center of the big man tales. Robot. Searching for the robot's missing components gave the former middle manager the chance to quietly reach an accord with the demented ghost of Hyperion past. <laughs> the dream of the vault seemed closer than ever. Unfortunately, any dream can quickly turn into a nightmare, and this nightmare's name was Valerie. Fortunately, Valerie's killing spree was interrupted when another dangerous adversary was suddenly revealed as a powerful ally. Now, supported by a legendary gladiator, their search continued through the icy wastes of the Borderlands to a forgotten Garden of Eden. There, they found another piece of the Gortis robot, as well as the last surviving man on the gladiator's murder bucket list. As she prepared to take revenge, I made a the con artist intervened. <laughs> That was the moment that Valerie chose to strike. Outgunned and outmaneuvered, the con artist and salary man were forced to surrender. Now, they were working for Valerie, and their first job was likely to be their last. All right, let's do it. Oh, that looks neat. Where are we exactly? Why you gotta kill Scrappy, man? Why you gotta kill Scrappy? Shelter. Looks like we're in for some showers. Oh, awesome! Yeah, let's let's do that. Can't wait. <laughs> Let's see. They're as charming as ever. Yeah. Looks like you're you're thinking. That suit he's wearing. It looks familiar, but I hmm, I can't place it. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. What do you mean it's what familiar? What is this guy getting out of all this? I can't figure it out. This endless march down memory lane. There's got to be a reason for it. He wants a vault. He I don't know. A vault. Why else would he be collecting Gordas pieces? He's just like every idiot on Pandora looking to strike it rich. Aren't, uh, aren't you kind of, you know, vault hunting now? Are you calling me an idiot? <laughs> yeah, that's what I did there. Yeah. <sighs> I feel like we should do something. If we get to those hills, maybe we could lose him. Yes, I don't know. What's he gonna do, huh? Shoot us both? We should just attack him. I mean, he's obviously yes, keeping us alive. Could jump him. Hey, you, what? There's two of us. Even you should like those odds. I mean, <laughs> if he <laughs> wanted us this? dead, he would kill us by now, right? Up. I'm making a break for it, and you should too. Remember, <laughs> zigzag when you run. Okay, it uh makes you harder to hit. That sounds stupid. It's not stupid. It's it's genius. Serpentine, man. Right. Serpentine. Going on three. One. Two. Three. Go! <laughs> what the hell was that? I don't know. Meteor shower. Get to the shelter. Good. Good running for it. Oh, God. Forgot, there's action commands I gotta do. The old zigzagoon man. <sighs> Good job. That was close. You evaded him. Was, well done. What's that? That's duct tape. <laughs> this again. <laughs> Clearly, I can't trust you two, so you just oh, gave man. away, Gordas. She was taken. And you were stuck under Valerie's gun. It was a rocket launcher, okay? It was massive. Even for her. Uh, San Sean, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the Rescue Force. You're awesome. I do appreciate that. Some Vaughn? love and hype. Vaughn! Shut up. Shut up. 
Oh, why'd you gotta be her, man? Oh! Stop it! Please. He's gonna feel that. Not so rough. Yes, ma'am. I like these bandits. They're like organized. Oh, sorry, sorry. boss. The nerd is gone. Some old dude with crazy hair ran off with it. That's okay. We've got what's important. There, there, little one. No need to be upset. I'll answer your questions. Please, just promise that you won't hurt anyone. Of course, dear. I don't want to hurt anyone. Don't trust her, Gordis. She's a bitch. Don't, don't do her, it. Gordis. Oh, don't listen to her. She's just being sore. Besides, if you don't tell me, I have to start hurting people again. And you don't want that. You? No! Gord, is she gonna kill us anyway? Uh, tell me about the Vault of the Traveler. The, the Vault of the Traveler teleports all over the universe, only staying in one spot for a few minutes before blinking away. But once I have my last piece, the beacon that's up on Helios, I can summon the Vault and hold it here. Then you collect treasure or something. What does the beacon look like? I... I don't know. But I'll know it when I see it. That's what happened with the last piece. Well, that's some exciting news. Vault Thank of the Traveler? You, that seems interesting. You're... You're welcome. Can I get away from you now? Of course. Oh, come on. The rock launcher's not that heavy. You, Fiona. Just so angry. <sighs> Is this about Athena? You're feeling you guilty. That's what. Leave her alone. You can't blame yourself, Athena. You couldn't even fight fair. You couldn't fight fair, could you? Had to call in some goons to take her on. Goons? I wouldn't call Brick and Mordecai that. They're highly trained vault hunters, and they deserve your respect. Now listen up. Under normal circumstances, your rotting corpses would already be getting torn apart by skags right now. And as opposed to now? But these are not normal circumstances. And with that last piece being on Helios, I can't think of a better crew than a pair of Pandoran con artists and a Hyperion stooge to figure out a way to get it for me. So you need us, so you can't kill us. Right. What do you say? And I'll give you a hint. The only right answer is yes. You don't buy any of this bullshit, Fiona. This is not. I mean, what's in it for us? <laughs> what's in it for us? What's in it for you? Well, for starters. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh Things shit! Like this will stop happening. Does that work for you? Oh or shit! Do you think we should negotiate more? Hey! What's it gonna be, Fiona? Don't give in. I I'm fine. Hey. You said you wouldn't hurt anyone. No. I said I didn't want to hurt anyone that go up. Shit. Stop. Yes, whatever you want. Please. Oh my God. That, that. Just leave her alone. That's got to hurt. I'm glad we were able to work this out. You didn't have to do that. Yeah, You shouldn't have given in. Shut up. What the hell is wrong with you two? We've got principles. Oh, shit. Son. <laughs> Yeah. Be a dear and help them oh, come up man. with a plan. Yes, ma'am. A Let's plan get for what? We have to get on Helios. This will be fun. Uh, hey, Zane. How you doing? I'm telling you, it's not possible. We can't do this. That's not an option. Neither is getting ourselves killed. One way or another, we're going to figure out how to pull this off. Okay, let's start with how we're gonna get there. Well, this isn't the first time we've had to get creative. We'll, we'll find a rocket. I'll just let it run. I'll just let it run I'm right loving now. your optimism. You're saying we can't? I'm saying it isn't. Thank you. I guess it boils down to this: somehow we've got to get to Helios, infiltrate Hyperion, and steal Gordis's vault beacon. Sorry, that was breakfast. <clears throat> Sorry, without getting ourselves killed. Yeah, that should be no totally shit, easy. Moron. I just said that like 30 seconds ago. Everyone knows what we have to do. We're just trying to figure out how to do it. Okay, okay. 
Well, some people like to say what we need to do again. Oh, hey, Jack. Come tell there, buddy. That'll teach you to hit the taco truck. Right now, I don't see how that's gonna Wow, you got the magic, kid. I mean, bottle the stuff. Call it weak sauce. And that's why we have to drill down. No, no, I'm sure there's there's greatness in there somewhere. We just could use your help here, Jack. Actually, I could use your help. Yeah, of course you could. Great. Is that a yes or no? What? You think old Jack would leave his meat buddy is, hanging? We don't have a choice. I Valerie's kind of honestly got don't know how to answer that. <sighs> you don't think I know so that? listen, maybe I hate to be the bearer of this news here, here, but if there's one thing you know about me, know. it's that I'm a collector you know of my rival's top secret projects. Fine. What's your solution? That's why I'm going to share this juicy know, little tidbit with you. But I know we have to do Once this upon a time, a few of my guys bought, yeah, borrowed an Atlas shipment that contained parts for one of their top secret projects. You got the beacon. And about a zillion other Atlas gizmos, too. That's the best tech in town right there. Especially their freaking guns. Oh, man. I got I got this one with a fist attachment. So you can literally punch someone in the face before you shoot them. <laughs> yeah, what I'm saying is this. I got your beacon somewhere in my office. Get in there. And it's mission accomplished, baby. I just don't see how we're gonna do this. So we just gotta we get. get we still beacon. have to get on Helios and get into dead. Jack's office. You're not helping. Oh great, Captain Obvious wants to speak. <sighs> shut up for just a second. Everyone, just please shut up for a second, again, because here, here's here's the deal. I, the beacon is in handsome Jack's office. You pulled that out of your ass. Well, check it out, smart guy. Run it by Gordis. Fine. Hey, put the little robot on. Listen, you got access to a map of Helios? I do. See if you can focus your scan for the beacon in Handsome Jack's old office. Beacon detected! We got a winner! I'm sending Reed the location. <laughs> see what we have here. Uh, we gotcha. Enhance? Oh, so you can say it. You're shitting me. <laughs> en <laughs> Enhance! That whole sector must be crawling with guards. Hey, give me one uh, reason why you think we could possibly enhance. break in. Enhance. Man. How many people you gotta kill to get an office like that? Bill. Tour the Jack I experience. You're scared. Hey, I am too, but working together, I think we have a shot. Great. Sign me up. I don't know how we're gonna get through this. Teamwork, that's how. Then you better have a damn good plan. Oh, it's killer. Behold, Helios. Okay, now how do we get there? Oh, well, the Helios is in space, so we need a spaceship, obviously. Well, we don't exactly have one lying around. Hey, what about Scooter? He said we could call him anytime. D yeah, Scooter's totally got a, just a spaceship, just. Well, you got yourself a rocket man, miss. Yeah! And then it's off to Helios. Oh, yeah. Come on. Oh, that works. Okay. Before we dock, I'll tell a bed we've arrived. She'll help us. Why not call her now? Now, the less she knows, the safer she is. Yvette, we're back. Awesome, Reese. You're a hero. I'll tell the guards to let you through. Somehow I feel like that just is not. That's not how this is playing out. That's then not. Then I'll how disable the security system. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We hacking. Yeah, that'll work. Act. Fiona, you'll take Sasha and Gordis and go to the hub of heroism. Now up on Helios, Jack's office is a museum, hallowed ground. Not even Vasquez had access. Looks like the only sure access is the VIP tour. Meet your new tour guides. <laughs> From there, we'll get into Jack's office. We're all. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, you'll need me for that, obviously. Once inside, Gordis will ID the piece. Wow! This place is huge! This way, please! And to the oh. victors go the spoils. Told you. Killer plan. Wait a minute. How are you going to pull any of this off? Hyperion wants you dead. Then I better go as someone else. Um. What? 
And for the grand finale... I'll digestruct a vast skies. But Hyperion's gonna want proof that Reese is dead. We'll use Vasquez's body. They'll never know the difference. This could actually maybe work. So I guess all that's left is pitching the plan to Valerie. She'll go for it. And getting me to Old Haven. And I'll go to Scooters. Wait a second. Hmm? So how did you figure out the pieces in Jack's office? Uh... Don't tell him, princess. They'll sabotage the whole freaking mission. It just uh. came out of nowhere. Don't do it. You'll only make things way I'm doing worse. it. I'm doing okay, it. Team, um, prepare to have your minds blown. I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm letting them know. I'm telling it's them what's up. In my head. God, oh, but damn it! Did you just just allow me to explain? Hey, when I plugged Nakayama's ID drive into my head port, I kind of accidentally uploaded an AI version of Jack into my brain. But, but it's cool. It's cool. I've I've got everything under control. <laughs> kind of. What? You had that murdering son of a bitch in your head all this time, and you didn't tell us? You asshole. This is gonna go August real well. Was a <laughs> okay. If Jack's really in there, I want to talk to him. You know, just give him a piece of my mind. Yeah, that's not happening. But he'll only talk to me. Oh, how convenient. Well, that went over well. Even your oddly ripped moron sidekick <laughs> took it better. Anyway, you know how it goes. Snitches get stitches. I just made that up. It's clever. So, when you slapped my ass back there, that was Jack? Yes. And here I thought of you as a friend. I'm oh, not shit. one to say I told you so, but, uh, <coughs> I told you so. Well, oh, good times, huh? Have fun cleaning up your mess. <laughs> hey, whoa, Listen, whoa, whoa. okay? I'm not the only one guilty of lying. You two do it for a living. Totally different. How is this it different? Is deceit, ladies. None of us are innocent. <sighs> Don't change the subject and stop calling us ladies. Let's just say, for argument's sake that you didn't mean to be a lying scumbag and that you understand that you should have shared what is an incredibly vital piece of information. So far, so good. I guess. Even if we could somehow trust you again... What? I'm still me? trust Jack? No more lies. You need to level with us from here on out. Look, say what you will about Jack, but you gotta admit, he saved our asses back at that Atlas facility. Even if what you're saying is true, that doesn't mean we can trust him. Oh, that, that, that option was quick. Uh oh. All right, uh, Valerie signed hey, up on the hi. plan. Reese is going with Finch and Kroger. The rest of us are off to Hollow Point to get this thing spacey. All right. Let's get to work. Kushala Cake, thank you so very much for subscribing. Welcome to the rescue force. Hope you enjoy your stay here. Some love and hype for him. Thank you so much. August. Jake did nothing wrong. I'll miss you. Apparently, I did everything wrong. I'm just sorry. Up. Here I, I am, just sitting here, just like, hey man. Thing. Jack in my head. But I like you so much. <laughs> All right, fine. Hey, have you got a plan for what to say to Scooter? Cause he screwed him out of a lot of money for those caravan repairs. He could be angry. Um. And I've heard stuff about what he did to the Zafford clan. He's a pretty jolly guy for someone who just buried another man alive. We'll be honest. Just We're going honest. Be honest. He likes us, and he's a he's a decent guy. Yeah. I mean, he'll probably jump at the chance to build something cool, right? Yeah, totally. It's my two favorite gals. Come to see your old sponsor, huh? How go the races? I know you sure like going fast, ha <laughs> ha. Wait, no, not like you're a fast woman or oh shoot. Uh like racing. It's great to see you too. We'll just avoid the subject entirely. I'm saying. Just I'll completely avoid the subject. Scooter, great to see you. Just an absolute pleasure. Every time I get to see your face, just mm. go on. <laughs> nah, you don't have to go on. I know my face is about as appealing as a dead dog. Somebody whacked a few times with a tire iron until it popped. 
But anyway, it's great to see you. What can I do you for? What? Scooter, please. Not saying that I want to do or nothing. To, no, it's, it, well, not that I'm saying I wouldn't either. Uh, we need a hero. You, like, open your mouths and make with the wording so I can, I can shut mine. We need your help. Valerie's after us, and if we can't equip the caravan with a rocket and fly to Helios, we're all dead. Y'all need me? Oh, man. I've always wanted to be somebody's knight in shining armor, saving all their lives and whatnot. Well, you're not quite. Uh -uh, uh -uh. Just let him have this. Just, just let it, I'm let it roll. A hero! Woo! Let it roll. That all sounds great. Only problem is funding. No, don't worry about it. Valerie will pay for whatever we need to get to Helios, get the Gordas piece, and get out. I understood exactly half those words. Let's do it. Oh, wait. When I said that there was only one problem, I meant that there were two. Because, look, I know a lot about cars and I know a lot about engines. But rockets are right out of my purview. My business partner knows rockets like you wouldn't believe. But she's, uh, she's a little out of sorts. Uh-huh. Oh, no. And he's been like that since she heard about some big bald hunter fight what happened out in the tundra. Athena ain't checked in for a while. She put two and two together. She ain't much of a mood to do rocket stuff. Aww. Maybe you should talk to her fee. You're the last one who saw Athena, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, this'll go real well. We need your help. Janie, I'm sorry about Athena. But we'd really like your help. Well, I'd like my girlfriend back. Looks to be a rough day for everybody. She said it was just an easy protection job. As if anything's ever easy out here. I really wanted to believe her. I did. But she forgot to turn her echo off the last time we spoke. Oh. I heard the two of you talking. Her echo went dead after the fighting started. I couldn't... What was she doing? Why did she lie to me? I need to know. I know she was protecting you, but why? She said it wouldn't be dangerous. She said... She was... Mm, training me. For what? To be a vault hunter. She wasn't putting herself in danger for her own sake. She was teaching me how to survive. Feels she wouldn't bad, do man. something like Feels that out bad. of the goodness of her heart. An old friend of ours hired her. Yeah? And where's he? Oh, hell. Athena. So what happened to her exactly? I've never seen Athena lose a fight. How'd she get grabbed? So long as she's got that shield, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on her. It doesn't make sense. She can't... Damn it. It took two Vault Hunters, and Valerie, and her entire gang just to take her down. Heh. <laughs> That's my girl. <laughs> Much better that way. awkward. Change the subject. These nice ladies want us to build a rocket for them. What do you say? I don't know if I love the Scooter. Parts. Mikey did a sure really good you. job. Oh, you just I just want to know one last thing. Uh, he's being completely ignored. Did she say anything about me before they took her? The way she acted. Sometimes I didn't even know if she liked me. Yeah, she like loved you. I was just a fluke or something. She told me to pass on a message. She said she loves you. She did? I... Oh, goodness. Okay. Yeah, yeah, she said that. She didn't say oh, that. Wow. She didn't say that. Young lady, you are going to have yourself a rocket. She didn't say that. And once I'm done building it, I'm going to grab every gun I can carry. I'm going to drive out of here. I'm going to rescue my girlfriend and I'm going to marry the piss out of her. I mean, I can probably build you something that'll break Atmo, but beyond that, you want a mechanic on board to make sure it doesn't explode on you. Is so Athena oh, dead? Man. No. That sounds like a job for the scooter man if I ever heard one. And considering it's a dream of mine to catch a ride into space and all that, it would be like just, just wow. Scooter. Yeah, we're bringing on? Scooter with us. We if we're going to bring a mechanic, mechanic, we're bringing you Scooter. Uh, thank you for the Space donation, Man. Captain Walken. The feels, man. The feels. Uh, for those wondering what happened to Athena, play the beginning of the pre-sequel. That's where she's currently at, with a gun held to her head by Lilith. 
That's currently where she's at. All right, here's how it's gonna go. The man with the plan right here is gonna track down the corpse. I mean, it's a corpse. It can't exactly have moved around that much. Okay, I get it. Off you go. It's a corpse. It's not gonna be that hard. All right, Reese. Let's just find Vasquez's body. It should be right where I left it. Not crap our pants. But you <laughs> are gonna have such a hard on for my office, Reese. It's well, <laughs> huge. Two out of three ain't bad. Uh, you know what? It's probably not a bad idea to get uh, a little dumpy rocking for some robo scouting. Yeah, yeah. Let the shiny toaster get blown to nuts and bolts instead of us. No. Ah. No, I don't want the little dude getting hurt. Noble. Stupid as hell. But noble. Listen, I. I let I let him die the first time. Okay, he blew up. He exploded. He's going everywhere into pieces. He holds a grudge against me. I'm not going to make him play as a bodyguard. All right. How do you marry the piss out of someone? Very careful. Uh, back here again. Can I soda. close the book on this weird chapter of my life? And five dollars from Seagull nine nine nine, who just says a little bit of rue love. Thank you for the donation, man. I see the skags. I mean, I see them. Why are we walking closer to them? Why are we walking closer to them? Why are we walking right next to them? Yeah, you better. Okay. Run. Yeah. Yeah. We'll just. Yeah. Q. Can I can I scan stuff? Oh, it's the Jackopedia. I wonder if that baby still got juice. <laughs> Want to plug your robo head in and see? I mean, it'll probably explode the shit out of your heart, but <laughs> feel like a primo hit of electric drugs to me. Come on, I know you want it. So isn't that what really matters? Yeah, we'll just plug ourselves into the power junction, explode our heart and die. That's a great idea, Jack. Then you'll die. Secret Atlas Communications Array. Got an, uh, it's got an antenna thingy. So that's probably sending signals. Something to do with TV. Oh man, you know what I just realized? I probably died before I found out who the dude's mom was in the thing. Let me look it up. Oh, that Oh, I love that. I believe that's a reference to what I think it is. If so, that's awesome. Uh. You see? I told you so. Wallet head. All right, wallet head. Time to show your face back on Helios. He's gonna be missing a face, isn't he? Face! Face is face! Has no face! Oh, you better hope a psycho didn't give it use a good it stare, a chat. Pizza. A skin pill. Oh, God. Oh, what were the pepperonis? A skin pizza. Oh, you clearly oh, haven't I been can't. on Pandora mm -mm. long enough, compadre. Uh -huh. All right. So his face is gone. Let's find Vasquez's face. Mm. Mm. And get out of here. You're the boss. Tasty. Nice and tasty. You know what? Not to blow up your ego, kid, but I see a real future for you at Hyperion. It's kind of future where two like-minded masters of their own fates could deal some serious damage. Huh? Huh? If you do as I say, Hyperion. I even name a ship after you someday. The SS Jack's Apprentice. Cool, right? <laughs> Company car, office with a view, Ugh, unlimited free lunches. I've earned it all. Yeah, that's the spirit, and you'll get it with my help. 
How? You gotta keep an eye on your friends during this healing. How do you need a free lunch huh? if you make millions of dollars? Unlike how you're not keeping an eye on that tripwire. Uh, what? Oh. <laughs> nice. Thanks, Jack. I'll just step right on over that. Huh? Oh, that's nasty. Well, looks like these psychos had themselves a little skin pizza party. Uh, how am I going to find Vasquez's face in all this mess? That's what an echo eyes for, genius. Scan the faces from a nice stab-free distance. Unless you want to get up close and physical with some new psycho pals. All right. Psychos. Scanning. Scanning. Oh, man, just look at that Ooh, face. Vasquez wasn't that ugly. It looks like a little angel. I'll tear your arms off and feed them to you if you wake them up. Oh, boy. You and me, pumpkin. Let's rock this walk. Whoa. This place is scaring me, and I'm a freaking hologram. All right. Uh, careful now. I want to end up psycho dinner. It's this one. one hell of a party. You know, in a messed up way, I kind of respect this psycho. Ah, I always thought I'd drink. Crazy dream last night. Too. I died, and I got Those turned into an AI. Really are and then I got sh shoved into your brain. And then, instead of trying to find a vault, you stood around and watched people sleep. <laughs> it's a never-ending barrage of action here, Reese. Real stand-up. Ten out of ten. Would insert my brain, insert myself into your brain again. Oof, oh, yeah. uh, disturbing. Not Vasquez's face disturbing, but weird. still disturbing. Glad I wasn't invited to this pizza party. Uh, snooze and psycho. Hey, she kiss his cheek. No, really, just kiss him on the cheek. It'll be funny. He probably won't wake up. Nobody gets a chance to just be around when these dudes, when they aren't murdering, so take advantage of it. Draw a dong on his face. You're an adult. You figure it out. You could draw a dick on his face. Could do it. Could do it. Disturb huh? sleep. Pattern? Oh, no. Oh, Wallace. Not no. No. Interrupt Rem Psycho. <laughs> All right, good, good. Again, this time with feeling. Give him the arm. How does he never punch down. with the mechanical boy. arm? Need rest. Big day tomorrow. You die, I sleep. Smacky oh. dabby. I should punch with this arm more often. Thank you. <laughs> Jesus. Enough because I'm about to compliment you. No one ever became a leader without dirtying their hands. Oh, you're gonna get Hugo McSwoopy Hair's face back. No bro. Huh. Kinda looks like my ex-girlfriend. I'd actually be okay with that. Ooh. Sorry, Stacy. Damn, Stacy. Sombrero psycho. <laughs> Spanish. To every person who speaks Spanish. I'm sorry. I can't read it. <laughs> uh, hey, you like that? Learn that shit to pick up a Truxican actress. Now a gentleman never kisses and tells. But let's just say we totally boned. Oh, well, thank you, Jack. I love that information from you. This guy wearing a, like, a little well, beer hat? Is he is. Night. You could read half of it? Perfect. says good night my heart bandit bandit of my heart eh chuggy mcchugs a lot there's nothing funny about alcoholism unless you're wearing one of these hats like just imagine that dude's wife screaming at him like what about our child and he's just slurping whiskey out of a bottle fixed to his head right this guy knows what i'm talking about like you know you got laid off, you got laid off your job, you don't got much going for you, your kids are crying, your wife's yelling at you, you're wearing, you know, the, the white, the white tank top with this thing attached to your head and you're sipping some wine. You just, you just need a moment. You just need a moment. Why did we go in depth on that one? 
Oh, hey, we found Vasquez's face. It's so hairy. So, so hairy, and yet so slimy, like somebody slam-dunked a terrier into a tub of nacho grease. What? The fuck? Oh, he's got... Uh, looks like we found our psycho. Of course it's you the suicide. You only psycho. see this kind of thing on Pandora. Uh, Get me back to Helios, Reese. Brit Oof, that is one ugly mug. Um, hey, artist, how you doing? Where... Where am I gonna put it? Cram it in your pocket, I don't know. I, I can't mess up his face or the Digistruck won't work. Just rip it off like a bandage. Quick and painful. Oh. Mm. Oh. Okay, just peeling it off. Peeling off the face. Not going to barf into his mouth. With your mouth. Oh. That's it, go on. Peel off that face like a serial killer. You're sick. Hmm, <laughs> look at that. Listen to that. Like, nice and crunchy. Oh, it feels like, you know, it's like that. That light, that like taffy mm. it's like he's got some taffy on his face and it's like making that nice little that peel sound man oh yeah that's delicious that is terrifying that's what that actually is Ooh, oh baby no, 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 no. oh it's stuck mm -mm. oh god <laughs> that's so cool. that, that is just the, the grossest thing i've ever seen oh god oh. i can't stop now oh no 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 you gotta, you gotta, 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 gotta do it, man. Just gotta. Whoop. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, oh pinch, pinch it off. Just pinch it oh, off. Reese. Seriously? Oh, please don't do it. Please, please, please don't do this to me. Oh, gross. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, there we go. <gasps> Smash the baby's face. Crunch its teeth. <laughs> Run! You're the only one running, pal. I can fly! <laughs> so, once I snatched that face, people, gross, I sprinted out of Old Haven. Hundreds, no, thousands of psychos chased me. Oh, really? That many? Couldn't even count them all. You were too busy trying to save face. Okay, technically, it was one psycho, but he had a bomb strapped to his chest that had the stopping power of, like, a thousand of... which could... So, one. One psycho. One. Yeah. But he had a bomb. Psycho. With chest bomb. Boom. Boom. You said something about a bomb, psycho? Oh. Yeah. There. <laughs> Whoa, wait, dude. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, we were supposed to bring back the body. Oh, we are still bringing it back. Oh. It's just going to take a little longer to collect now. Think I got some baggies in the truck. It's baggies? Oh, yeah. Let's just, we'll just p pick all those <laughs> little pieces up and just... Oh, That's nasty. That's nasty. That's sick. That's disgusting. Okay. Oh, man. That's squishy. That's what that is. Ugh. That is squishy. It ain't pretty, but this one fits your budget. Ugh. Are Hyperion costumes necessary? Fiona should fit in on Helios, but you, Sasha? No way, man. Hey, here's your disguise allowance. Don't think it'll be a regular thing or nothing. Get yourself something or get Sasha something nicer so she'll quit whining. Don't care either way. Just don't look Pandoran or this mission will be over before it even started. Can I get a nice little outfit? Can I get so, some nice? what are you going to get, sis? All right, let's see what we're working with. Standard. Hey, Fiona, the uh, <clears throat> pricier option ain't too shabby. Plus, I kind of want you to spend all of August's money. 
Hey. Or whatever. Just pick something that says, I look like a stuck-up jerk. Yeah, <laughs> that'll work. Oh, man. A high-flying Hyperion? Which one do we go with? Which one do we go with? Steampunk... I gotta go with the Flaming Phoenix. It looks so good. Disclaimer. Actual ship product may not be fire resistant, depending on who you ask. But there's really cool Phoenix on the back. Dude, I gotta get that. I gotta get that. Hell yeah. Ooh, that'll look good. Yeah. Are you both blind? Okay. Now, do I get Fiona something? I ah, oh, she's gonna want that pricier option. She's gonna want the pricier option. Hmm. Or I could get her nothing. Oh, even better. I could get her nothing. Yes. Do I get her nothing? I think I get her nothing. I honestly, like, I'm going to just say straight up that the cheaper one looks better. Like, the cheaper one looks better. That's just my opinion there. I'm gonna go with the cheaper one. All right, thanks, V. I'll try it on in a bit. Hope it's worth the cash. Could have bought a lot of guns with that. Yeah, we're done. Shooter. You look like a dream. You're up, Sash. Make it quick. But we already. We already did it. You did the thing. Not impressing anyone with this, but it's all right. I'm so, sorry. Uh, I'm sorry about earlier. I'm sorry. So, are we talking about lying about Jack or when you slapped Mike? Both. I'm I'm talking about both because they're, uh, they're 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 related. They're related. We're just we're just combining all just of it into one. And Jack was able to take control over me for a bit, away. and it. Well, it went how it went. Not that that's an excuse. It's, it's just what happened. And I wanted to say I'm sorry. I'm not even going to ask. Yeah, it's probably better that way. Hey, is this disguise going to work? Yeah. I figure you're the one with the eye for this. You look you like corporate scum. Um, no, I probably shouldn't I say that. And you dress terrible. So maybe I should just take my chances. Yeah, it suits you. Is that a pun? Oh, no. <laughs> that is hilarious. I get it. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm still just, just flopping them. <laughs> I'm just flopping okay. this around. But I'm going to be burning these clothes once this is over. Naturally. Anyway, it's all yours. Just flop Thanks. it around, just man. Just scan swing it. Severed face here. Yeah. Have fun with that. Just get to the skin screen and... Please scan skin. Oh, there we go. Okay, skin scan. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> Much worse from this side. <laughs> skin unlocked. Oh. Hey. <sighs> That's convincing. Is it? Yeah, I mean, you look like a complete douchebag. Excellent. That is the look I was going for. Nice. This of course is... I do, Vixen. <laughs> oh, definitely weird. Nice little button. Let's just throw it right here. Well, it's certainly 
big. Oh, that's <gasps> that's scooter for you. And we just built that? Okay. Yeah. I hope Vaughn's all right. Yeah. I'm sure Cassius yeah, is looking sense. out for that's him. That's good. We'll track them down when we get back. Yeah. Uh, Hummerhead, thank you for two months, man. Appreciate that. Yes. Yes. who the art direction was by don't blow chunks don't you dare don't you do it uh oh it's coming he's trying to get out it's ha oh it's happening it's happening the puke is coming the puke Hold my hand, chat, please. Hold my hand. Afternoon, Leo Kira. How you doing? All right. So now we're back on the moon. I like it. Fee, you gotta see this. <laughs> Little help? Not a problem. That's creepy. Right. Sorry. Okay. What are we looking at? Oh, you're looking at Pandora. It looks like a giant rock. I know it's where we're from, but... It's never felt like home to me. I... I didn't think I'd ever see this. It looks so... I don't... It gives you perspective. Peaceful. Now you can thought. see how much of it is a wasteland. I haven't even gone that far, and it all feels a million miles away. It puts things in perspective. Everything that we've gone through, it all seems so small from up here. Yeah, it does. It's a shame we have to go back. Wish we could just turn this thing towards the nearest planet. We'd probably run out of fuel, so it's not a one good day, idea. But one day we, one won't, day have we won't have to. We'll be able to pick whichever planet we want. <laughs> I can't wait. 
I keep forgetting they're here. Once we get the beacon, we'll figure out a way to turn things back in our favor. Any ideas on how exactly we do that? Or are we just winging it? Nah, we just wing it. Again. Eh, we wing it. <laughs> of course we do. When you're good at something, why stop? Hey, watch it. Oh, sorry, man. Just got a wife for me is all. It ain't bleeding or nothing. What the hell is this damn thing? What? It's, uh... Well, it's a satellite. Gonna launch it to, to advertise my franchise. You know what they say? Ain't no ad space like outer space. Of all the brands, you pick the one Hyperion hates. We're not drawing more attention to ourselves for some publicity stunt. Hey, there's no Whoa! need for that. Stop it! Come on, man. I gotta get some out of this trip. We won't be alive to collect it if we get blown into dust. He's earned it. Just let we him have right a damn on this trip. If it weren't for him, we'd still be stuck down on Pandora. And August, what exactly have you done for this mission? That's what I thought. Oh, oh damn. Whatever. Awesome! That seems like a bad idea. Well, no one asked you. <laughs> that feel when you've done nothing. <laughs> yeah, you should probably be flying the thing so we don't die. Is that a person? Oh, <laughs> he's still floating. Henderson. He's still sleeping. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. No shit. Tell us something we don't know. Did you know the damage is critical? <laughs> I like oh, a smart ass. I, I knew it. I knew it. Whose idea was it to bring this tin can? Um, how critical exactly? Without additional thrust, the ship will be pulled back towards Pandora. So it's real bad. Pretty bad. Yeah. I like a okay, sassy robot. This is what this right is the here. kind of AI you we need. Luck, that's my specialty. Need a little bit of sass. Turn your mother rockets up to eleven. Up to eleven. <laughs> Oh man, I got like 50 lines I want to say about full thrust. It's like a, a jump line. Things thing are the breaking the off man. of the ship. No way, man. I'm just getting stirred. There are things coming off the thing. That's normal. This is normal? <laughs> yeah, we're running like real hot right now. Yeah, like crazy hot. What we got to do? This is our only shot. Okay. We're about to hit a sky velocity, and when we do, you gotta shut these puppies down, you hear? Yeah, yeah, I hear. Do you? How can you hear anything? Achieving escape velocity in five, four, uh -huh. three, two, one. Go! Yeah. <laughs> we do it? Where are oh, we at now? Man, why are the alarms still going? Now that was just step one. We can't do step two without step one. Thank you, Scooter. Is there a rocket failure imminent? What does that mean? They're going to explode. Oh. Step two, let's nice. do this! Uh, when are they gonna explode? Very soon. <laughs> uh, uh, step two? What's step two? We get out there and we handle these uncooperative rockets. Oh, Very soon. Right. That's when they're going to explode. Like right now. What? Huh? What? Huh? This seems like a great idea. Uh, don't you worry, your pretty little. Yeah, all of you. Yeah, yourself. But I'll be walking you through it, though. Um. Okay. Yeah. The science is so bad. Why can't these guys do it? Well, that's the idea. Why can't they do it? All right, you go that way towards the rocket, and I'll take care of the other one. Listen, we ain't got much time. Be careful, Fee. Okay. That's right. Easy does it. Oh, 
man, this. This is all kinds of do not want. Oh, shit. Hey, grab it back oh. grab it back on. We don't need you going flying into space now. That's right. Easy does it. The O2 is open on the bottom side. Shh. No logic. Hey, hey. Hi, you're doing great. All right, now what? Okay, I'm here. All right, now see that panel there that keeps opening and shutting? Yeah. Why is it doing that? Uh, dangerous looking one? Yeah, that's it. Now there's a yellow button in there that you got to push. That's step one. Well, we're on step right. two. The button wedged all the way in the back. Oh, you got it. All right. No! What? <laughs> when you press it, you gotta pull your arm out real quick because it's gonna clamp down something fierce. You got me? Why? Careful. Why did you design You're this like this? There. All right. Got it. Left rocket stable, Fiona. All right. Now pull the latch to detach that sucker while we still can. What? What latch? Oh, that latch. Gotcha. At least this one doesn't try and, like, just chop my arm off. Oh. Well, it's, uh... It's stabilized, all right. Uh... Awesome. Now get your ass over to my side. Make it fast. Uh... Yeah, rocket is stabilized. What are you doing? Can I get a roops from my subs, please? Guys, that rocket's at critical. You gotta hurry. No compensation. Pull you out. One. No, no, I, I can pull you out. Listen, there ain't nothing you can do that I ain't already tried, okay? That's gonna be happening. It's good or don't die. Uh, what's going on out there? Nothing. Don't you good. worry. Fiona's got this. No. Scooter, don't hey. die. Hey. You got to go over there. Pull that latch and cut this rocket loose. Oh, don't you dare. There's no time for anything else, you understand? I'm not leaving you, Scooter. You do it or else the whole ship's going to go. No, I am not leaving you. That is not an option. It is, and that's the only option, all right? No. no. Fiona, look at me. This baby's going to blow, okay? That is happening. And you can't be here when it does. Scooter, no. Don't die. Don't die on me, Scooter. Now, don't you go feeling all sorry for me, all right? People on Pandora will be talking about old Scooter for a long time. Can't think of a more epic way to go. Y'all should be so lucky. You're a hero. You know that, You're a hero, right? Scooter. I kind of am, huh? You are. Well, it feels good. Right rocket is way past critical, guys. I should have hugged him. I should have hugged him. I'm not going on. I gotta catch a ride. Step three. All right, y'all. I didn't think about step it's three. Right in, but you see Moxie Arelli, you tell him I did some awesome shit. Okay? It's been real. Catch a
That was the first casualty of the mission. Bye, Scooter. They killed off Scooter. So, what did you do next? We honored Scooter. What did we do? We honored him as best we could. He truly earned this. It's the least we can do. Make it something good. It's the least we can do. Oh, I gotta go with Cowboy Bebop. I gotta go with Cowboy Bebop, man. So long, Space Cowboy. I sad. know what it is like to lose someone you care about. The worst part is, Scooter was the best of us. He deserves so much better. He was and definitely one Orlan's of the nicest serious people fan. I met on Pandora. Although that's not probably saying much. Anyway, we didn't have much time to mourn and all that. Things started to get crazy the minute we landed on Helios. So, uh, if that's not it, uh, answering. Perfect. You have entered Hyperion airspace. Identify yourselves immediately. Okay, gang. <laughs> there we go. I repeat, identify yourselves or you will be shot down. Do not come any closer. It's your boss. It's your boss, jackass. We'll see about that. Uh... Well, I remember. You're the funny one. We'll see how funny I am when you get down here. I know you're excited that I'm back, so I'll let that slide. Uh... Did they replace me already? Dude, I just can't believe they took out... They took out Scooter like that, man. They took him out. I'm hoping he comes back. They got they can't kill off Scooter. They can't kill off Scooter, man. After I get inside and disable security, I'll call you when it's safe to come out. Time to put on the game face. This is how you would talk. Providence. Well, now, if it isn't Cockknock and Tweedledick, how's about you get out of my way and let me go do my job? I really hope I get an excuse to kill you. Orders are to verify what the hell you were doing down on Pandora. Uh. Yeah, take it easy, guys. I just landed. In a hunk of Pandoran trash, no less. With half a loader bot stuck to the top. Hi. Hi. And what's that thing you launched, Reed? Something about anime? <laughs> well, I hope for your sake that wasn't a doll satellite. You see, we blow that shit out of the sky. Which is what we're gonna do to you if you don't tell us the truth. So, what were you doing down there? Tracking... Too off in the top oh, right I gotta. <laughs> dirt pile. I gotta. You wanna know what I was doing on Pandora? Your mom. My mom is dead. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, but I got, you know, very important places to be. So I'll just be <laughs> on my way. Oh, nah. god damn it. Nah. What do you mean, nah? Here's how it is. You come up here full of piss and bullets, and the first thing you do is dishonor the memory of my mom. 
Honest I mistake, know. man. You're not going anywhere. The honest mistake. I'll take it from here. <sighs> Eva, it's so good to see you. We need to catch up. Bring it in for testing. <sighs> what the hell happened to Reese? This is unbelievable. Listen, can we talk it a little? It wasn't supposed to go down like this. Let's talk. Can we let's talk, talk somewhere private. that's less exposed? We're fine right here. I'd like to shed more light on the situation. The situation is that you brought Reese back in pieces. Our deal was clear. You were supposed to retrieve his head so management could download whatever the hell was inside of there that was so damn valuable. Now we'll never collect the reward. Because you lost a critical Hyperion asset. Deal? What deal? It's a little late to play dumb, Hugo. So we agreed that I'd bring you Reese's head? Uh... This is priceless. You had one job, and, well... You blew it. You s little bitch. I'm taking you straight to management. Let's see how you like answering to them. I've had it with you. Let's see how big of a smart ass you are under questioning. How many baggies would you like? Excuse me? Well, it's just that my colleagues tend to die badly. Henderson, Reese, I could go on. And if things were to go south, I'd like to know your preference. One big bag or a bunch of little ones? Maybe with the cute zip ties? They make them in a million colors. Never start what you can't finish. She is a traitor. I, okay, all right. So we can't trust Yvette. That's wait, where'd the nerd go? Where's Vaughn in all this? What happened to him? I legitimately forgot. The Tell us when it's safe to move. The vet's scanning the body, so we gotta oh. hurry. I'm taking over the cameras now. Oh boy. Child's play. <laughs> Wins.exe? Reese wins. Dot ex. What is this doing? And we're linked. I don't know for the password. All right, all right. You want to dance? Let's dance. Uh. Hey, not bad, killer. Good luck keeping up the pace, though. Uh oh. Uh oh. That little cyber arm of yours is getting. Uh oh. Tired. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's child's play, right, pal? Well, the security is a bit tougher than I expected. Uh -oh. And now I wrote the program. So let's send an icebreaker into that frozen sea of code, shall we? <laughs> Jax Hex. Jack Hex, Jack, coming at you, baby. Damn, we freaking rule. And that is not the royal we this time. <laughs> huh. This is not Security how firewalls really work. Breached. Now, go for it. Should lay though. waste, my son. This is how firewalls should work. Just one sec. Let me find you. Uh. Nope. Is that it? What are you doing? Hello. Okay, bye. Uh... Oh, hey, there you are. There you are. Fiona, I'm in. Nice work. Yeah, if I do say so myself. Tell us where to go, Reese. Uh, the door's up ahead. Nice little phoenix. See? The phoenix is what matters here. Phoenix matters. 
Okay, we're at the hub of heroism. Great. The elevator to Jack's office is across the atrium. That's where the tours meet. Got it. Looks like it's time to put on our tour guide hat. We only need their badge, and then we're out of here. Although I could use a new hat. Pretending to be a tour guide for a place we've never been and know nothing about. This'll end well. Oh yeah, this'll be great. Let's just go nab it. Wait. Do they keep doing that? Hyperion Crow. Let's talk to Gordis real quick. Hey Gordis. How are you feeling about all this? You ready for this? I was fabricated, programmed, and wired ready. I was also built to dance. That's cute. That's cute. Can I oh pick oh you know I'm gonna you know I'm gonna just slide my hand in there and just pull something out real quick. You know I'm gonna do that. Oh 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 they loaded. Hyperion Big Shot. Let's talk to him. Looks fun. Howdy. No, who, right? Some lady's trying to get my attention when clearly I'm having an important conversation. So, uh, what are you wearing? I don't even feel bad now. Look at these assholes. So proud of themselves. I wonder if they know they're evil. What a bunch of losers. All right. Handsome Jack Memorial and Tour. It's like they worship. They kind of do. Hey, Finch. What the hell are you doing here? Motivational speaker. Said my gun doesn't talk. Do your job, or you'll hear what she has to say. I don't want to hear what she has to say. I'll just leave you alone, man. Bauer, no, stealing is wrong. No, stealing is right for me right now. Stealing is correct. Spot our tour guide yet? Not yet. Reese, we need an assist. All right, checking the schedule. Checking the schedule. All right, a guide will be coming off our tour any second. We're on it. Nope, not a tour guide. That doesn't look like a tour guide. What, this guy? Nope. All right, there's a tour guide. All right. Well. Standard distract and grab. Yeah. Yeah, I'm in position beast. behind the tour guide. Just walk up That's to her and to get her talking. grab First the guide. I find, I'll Should be easy enough. Oh, oh, oh! What about me? Oh, you've got the most important job of all, Gordis. Once I have the badge, you got to get the tour guide out of the room. Roger that, General Captain Lieutenant Ma'am. Private Gordis is on the job. She's so cute. Can you believe they call that stuff in the cafeteria food? <laughs> That's why I stick to coffee. Hides the whiskey on my breath. Ooh. Woman after my own heart. Just Ugh, drink it on the job. If Hyperion served real food, not that free hyperhydrated crap, I bet productivity would include. Just grab that. Uh oh. Oh, come on. Would you care for another glass of whatever it is humans drink? Uranium milk, perhaps? Ooh. Oh, my outfit's ruined. Still got it. Oh no, this is so terrible. Nothing gets coffee and whiskey out. You. Do you have any idea who this is? A uh, nice tour guide lady? The tour guide lady. <laughs> Come on. I'll help you find Smooth. Your clothes. You know, have you ever considered a management position? I mean, the way you demean that little robot, you'd be perfect. Where do I put in my application? All right, cool. Hello, Reese. You have the privilege of speaking to Helios's newest tour guide. Well done. Your criminal instinct 
I like how no one means, no no one notices Gord. It's just kind of walking around. Please don't say hi, Damn it. What? What's happening? They know they've been hacked. I got this, but you need to hurry and keep a low profile. I mean. Okay. Keep your eyes on the prize. How how low of a profile do you keep when sneaking in through an area you're not supposed to be in? Attention, Helios is on heightened alert. Please report any suspicious activity immediately. That's fine. We'll just walk straight. I know what the office looks like. Oh. What? Fiona, I don't like their faces. They aren't moving. Uh, um, who's this? Uh, she barely looks Hyperion. Uh, said pretty though. Pretty suspicious. Tor tor so, mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys are a tour group. We're the Handsome Jack VIP experience. The best tour money can buy. It better be. So, are you gonna give us the tour or not? Uh, yeah. Oh. Uh. Yeah. You've kept us waiting long enough. Yeah, let's start the tour already. I don't Lose appreciate attitude. your attitude. And I don't appreciate your tardiness. Well, we can't always get what we want, now can we? Handsome Jack always did, and we will too. Oh my god, you are a spoiled right. little brat, and I will slap. VIPs. I will slap. Well, get ready for a once-in-a-lifetime experience. For all How can she slap? All right, well, his office is on the other side of the room. How about we just, like, walk all the way Here over there? Here we go. The uh, first stop of the Handsome Jack VIP experience. This depicts... Oh, I cannot wait to hear about this. Ooh. Ah. Handsome Jack's what? father. Uh, scene. Handsome Jack's father. Defeating, um... What a badass. Cool. Giant My eyeball people. Likes on, I suppose. The giant eyeball people who, <laughs> you know, were ironically all blind. Whoa. Whoa. You were totally blowing my mind right now. Dude. Oh. Guys. Quite a sight to behold, isn't it? This. My friends. What if she's telling the truth? No freaking way. This is like his favorite snack. Well, little known fact, Handsome Jack loved eating Pandora balls, which is a special breed of pony made entirely of diamonds. What if she's telling Jack the truth? Consuming diamond horse meat would and allow we've him to been be well playing now. a joke the whole time. Fuck it. And, uh, Boom. You think we'll get to try diamond meat on the tour? It grabs yeah, not like guns for no reason. It, the stallion will craft high velocity weaponry. Oh, so this is butt stallion. Ooh. Oh, Whoa. Okay. If you'll okay. follow me, we're on to our third and final exhibit. Oh, I can't wait. Um. Uh, yeah, what is this? Uh, uh kind of just looks like a chair. It's a metaphor. Uh, I think I have one like that in my office. It's just a chair. But what it represents is an idea. Jack started as a lowly programmer sitting in a chair just like this. And now he has a VIP tour dedicated to his greatness. Just imagine where your chairs might take you. Straight to the top, baby. I'm sorry oh. about that. I had to leave my chair for a throne. You catch my drift. Wait a minute. That wasn't an exhibit at all. So, why would you tell us that it is? Uh, I think they call people like that liars. That was a test, people. And you failed. Wait, what? How does that work? All right, enough chit chat. Come on through so you can see Jack's office. <sighs> uh oh. 
Uh oh. I'm gonna need you to step aside and raise your arms. Ho oh, ho, I knew there was something off about her. Yeah, she was weirdly ignorant for a guy. Yeah. You're banned oh, for thunder. life. Guess what? You're banned from tours for life. Y you can't do that. I just Should did. Nicer? I won't stand for this. Tough break, kid. Maybe next time you'll show some respect. What's this? It was a gift. What's in it? Look for yourself. No metal objects. Next time it's mine. Understood. What is that? I never Woo looked at it. <laughs> We're almost there. I never looked at that object and now I don't know what event. it is. I don't want to know you what it can't is. Ruin this for me. Alright. Can you ID the beacon? It's gotta be in there somewhere. Let me look. Hmm. Can't see it from here. Maybe I can just Ooh. stop. Why? Oh boy. I, I I I can't believe we're here. Uh here it is. Your hero's office. Is it safe to go inside? No. Actually, uh, yes. It ought to be. I paid good money for this. Uh uh. Yeah, sure, go for it. Yeah, go ahead. Jack VIP experience. That means going all the way. Oh, sure. Yeah, go ahead. Walk right in. Go for it. Handsome Jack, here I come. Force field breach detected. Security lockdown engaged. Thank you for taking the Handsome Jack VIP experience. Oh, we hope man. you enjoyed your tour. You're on Goodbye. Your own, lady. I ain't cleaning that suit up again. That's a heavy duty looking door. They got disintegrated. This I don't even feel bad. All right, so obviously uh, we can just get through this by typing in the right password. Damn it. Come on, you got this, Gordis. You got it. Keep going. Sorry, hold on. Yeah? I can't get into Jack's office. What? You gotta be kidding me. You had one job. Oh, come on. Listen, oh, just come open on. the door. Just open the door. Just do your wacky, hacky thing so I can get in. Okay. Wacky hacky is the worst thing you've ever said to me, and, and and that is saying a lot. I I I can't seem to get in. I mean, the, the lockdown security system must be on a local grid or something. Now, so I can understand. It means that we need another way in. Okay, okay, we just I just need to think about this for a second, and uh, maybe if we uh, um um hold tight, okay, I gotta call you back. That's here. Crap. He said to hold tight. <laughs> well, what's he doing in there? Damn it. Gordis is so adorable. Newsflash, asshole. This is my office now. First, you give me a body that isn't Reese, then you go hacking my computer. What are you doing? You're trying to pull something. I know it. What am I doing? What are you doing? Everything in this office is mine now, which technically means you're breaching security. Oh. We had a deal, asshole. I tracked Reese and Bond all across Pandora for you. I refused them supplies when they needed them. And all you had to do was bring me whatever the hell was living inside Reese's head. I knew I shouldn't have trusted you. Of course, you betrayed me. You're only out for yourself. You traitor. Oh, grow up. It's just an office. But you still haven't answered me. Why bring a body that wasn't Reese? I can't believe you thought I wouldn't find out. Well, you seriously underestimated me. You're right. Reese isn't dead. What? I have no idea what's going on here, but I don't like it. I'm calling security. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> and, uh, get her off that phone if I was you, unless you want to be a bullet sponge. I need your help, I need Jack. Your... Yeah, cool. Time to decide what's mightier, the pen or the punch. 
All security officers are busy. Please don't be attacked. Hold. Thank you. A reminder, if you have been wounded by gunfire, please hang up and dial emergency. Let's talk it out. Services. We'll talk it out. We need to talk. Oh, yeah? What about? You got this, pal. Don't mess it up or we'll die. Security officers are busy eliminating other threats and will take your call in the order it was received. Everything is gonna be fine. Okay, by tomorrow you'll be sipping macchiatos with the rest of the galaxy's most morally flexible. That's not your style, Hugo. What are you playing at? Oh, it's probably because I'm Reese. <laughs> Reese? Reese! Done the bitch! Hey Jack, don't forget me! You can't just walk around telling people who you really are. I mean, they're not unless you want me to sap them. Although, I do really... That was worth it. Enjoy sapping. That was worth it. So much. I mean, a lot. Miss it. Wouldn't have thought I missed it so That was worth it. It was worth it. Ooh, cold. <laughs> Look at you. Thank you for the continued like support. So, yeah, anyway, stop doing that. Okay, bye. Justice. Just taking her out wasn't enough. She had to know who I was. Then we stun her. That's the downfall of most... Of most villains is that they have to let their plan known be before it goes through. Feel but hey, you there? it feels Wait, so much why better. Took you so long? Do you forget that we have, a, you know, a mission to accomplish? Yvette sold us out to Vasquez. I thought she was our friend. Oh, friends are rare when money's on the table. I'm sorry, Reese. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Oh, yeah, Jack's office is on total lockdown and I can't get the beacon. Little help? Uh... I'm working on it. Well, work faster. Uh oh. No vegan means no vault means everybody's gonna die. At least we're all doomed together. Yay! Come on, Reese. It'll come. At least Gordis has got like this nice, happy, cheerful thing going on. You know, if I were you with that stun baton, I would have drained the friggin' battery on it back. Well, that's not quite true. If I were you, I would have bought Yvette a one-way ticket to strangulation town with a brief stop at making her eyes bug out real weird station. I mean, actually, legally. That's what you're supposed to do to traitors. Yeah, yeah. I wrote it into the bylaws. Just... Jack, if you're not here to help, get lost. Wraith, what's going on? Are you are you talking to Jack? Hey, hey, pipe down for a second, please. Jack says he might have a way out of this. Oh, I'm sorry. Was he teaching you how to be a bigger <laughs> dick? <laughs> I'll leave you to it. As I was saying, I'm here to hell. Just surprised a handsome Jack fan like you doesn't know I... I'm a trap door in my office. And let me tell you, you're gonna love it. As long as blood doesn't make you squeamish and yeah, make How? some brains and whatnot. Not to uh, burst 13 your bubble or anything, but 14 months, man. Thank you. Just a little cliche. So is saying burst your bubble. What's your point? Uh, that I'm surprised a man of your distinct tastes would have one? It's a time-honored tradition used by generations of Hyperion CEOs. You know, I, I feel... Like you're mocking my culture. It's just it's a just... trap door. Jeez. Uh, All right, fine. It's not just a trap door. It's the centerpiece of your new plan. Uh, you're gonna need to go I in the outhole hole while someone yanks the lever. It's not as sexy uh? as it sounds. A lot of people died down there. No, oh, what did I agree to? A brilliant <sighs> plan. With my office on lockdown, climbing up the trap door is the only way in. And you get to do it all from the safety of a prison cell. I mean, I I've heard of some killer plans in my time, but this one takes the cupcake. You're telling me I will be the first person to go through your trapdoor and live to tell about it? First and probably the last? Nice. Well, okay, then. Guess that counts Let's as go. a plan. Yeah, it does. All right, the first step, though, is to make sure that con artist babe of yours joins you on the prison level and we're golden. You can access the jackhole there. So, did Jack bestow any pearls of wisdom? Yeah, more or less. Well, let's hear it. Hey, Fee, you have got to see the head tour guide's office. The view is unbelievable. Oh, Not yeah. now. We gotta change the plan. What's up? 
You need to get down to the prison level now. Got it. On my way. I like how no right. one notices See the picture there. on the name tag. Wait, how? It's my nice. clearance for that. Oh, uh, right. Uh, just get arrested. Arrested? <laughs> yeah, that's the exact opposite of what we've been trying to do. Just do it and do it quick. I gotta go. All right. We do this Pandoran style. It's your idea of Pandoran style. Batustalion! Putting this horse down. Oh shit! Except I'm we're ready not. For prison life. <gasps> why? Why is it? You didn't see anything. Why is it doing that? Stop why is it bleeding? There's, there's blood. Why is there blood? What? Maybe it was just filled with strawberry jam. What? Why is Butt Stallion bleeding? I told you just Diamonds! Wait, I just wait, shot yeah. Butt Stallion. Vaughn? Vaughn? Hey, I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm with Cassius. He saved me back there, and we're just... I don't know where, but we're eating Drake fruit. Oh, hey. Wanna... With the... Vaughn? With the thing. Vaughn? Uh oh. Hi. Talk or walk, ladies. I don't have time for both. You made me and my accounting boys look like idiots with that 10 million you stole. It's gonna take years to do all the paperwork. Better. Up to it. <clears throat> Sorry. Just ate a burrito. Never mess with accountants, Vasquez. You can always count on us outnumbering you. Smoke them. What are you doing? What are you doing? Got them all. Finger guns. Oh yeah. Got them now. Get him. What? We got a couple more. Oh. Paused it. Hit me. Knock that table over. Oh, he's throwing a grenade. We gotta get out of here. Up, bitches. Oh, hit that out of the park. Yeah. Oh, we pulling his own grenade? Oh, we are. We're pulling his own grenade. Dude, you're about to die. Oh, yeah. Here's some more for ya. It's an army down there. You're not allergic to lead. Oh, we're going for it. We're going for it. We're going for it. Badass accountant. Definitely a virgin. Chica, bitch, chica. These are the bullets. I've been counting. Get down. Bazooka. Get him. Yeah, you. Yeah, you forgot, man. You died. Don't be that guy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There's more with guns. It's the way out of this. Oh yeah! Going crazy! Going crazy! That guy don't seem to care though. That guy's still walking. Still on that call. 
<laughs> oh, yeah. Right. Took them all out. I have no idea what that was or what I just experienced. Hey, you know, right, you know, screw this thing. You saw nothing, okay? Sometimes the light plays tricks. Makes a statue look like it's seeping blood, but it's all just in your head. I know a bleeding statue when I you see one. Hey, hey, what's going on here with you all? How's it going? Oh, hi, Reese. Things are going great. Did you just say Reese? Nothing. <laughs> Uh, I could have swore you said Reese. Isn't that the name of the dead guy they picked up on Pandora? He said I release. I think she said release. Release? Yeah, like, hey, release me. How pathetic. Right. Except what she apparently said was, Oh, hi, release. Things are going great. Yeah, that's a weird sentence, isn't it? So oh, what I is it that I can help you with, Mr. Vasquez? Because <sighs> if it's related to the incident upstairs, this is all under control. Just another case of vandalism on the Handsome Jack tour. Yeah, I've got some heavy interrogation ahead of me with this Pandoran scum. Interrogation? Oh, yeah, you don't do... Whatever they did, and not get some interrogation for your trouble. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I guess so. Thank you for the five dollar donation, Captain some Walken. Lunch or something. Hey, I hear the macaroni is good. I got this handled. I do love macaroni. Let me know if you need anything. Well do. Oh yeah, macaroni and cheese. Yeah. Nice Bye -bye. job. Is there any reason for you to take off that disguise? So, what is this plan exactly? Jack told me about a trap Chaz door trap doors that we're going to climb through. We just a lot of dead bodies. Way up. It's going to stink. Yeah, it's going to stink. So I'm guessing the plan doesn't involve you getting most by a death machine? No, that's that's a problem. We got to get past How can it. We help? By figuring out a way to shut that thing off so I can get up there. But now I pull you up on the comm so you can identify the piece. Sounds like a plan. I just love her Wait, energy. We gotta go up that scary dark hole? I think Reese is the only one scrawny enough to fit. Hey, Gordis, you, uh, you wanna go first? Huh? Yeah? No, thank you. Oh, oh. Aren't robots supposed to obey orders or something? Alright. How about you, Fiona? You want to go up Seems there? Like a fun place, huh? No wonder you're single. Wow. I was joking. Wow. That's what I meant. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Sure. Huh. That is definitely a switch. Okay. All right, I get it now. So, Fiona, I need you to hold this while Gordis boosts me up. Yeah. Don't worry about hurting me. Just climb on up. Well, I guess it's tough to hurt someone made of metal. Oh no, this is excruciatingly painful. But hey, I'm a team player. And that's this the kind of team member we need. Oh, you haven't been around him as long as I have. How could you possibly doubt? Possibly that. Oh, okay, are you are you are you moving? Not even a little. I got this. Looks like it. All right, let's do it. All right, Gordis, just give me a little boost up there. No problem. Hurry up, Reese. Okay. Oh! Woo! <laughs> nice catch. Almost right into the How blade. Better than 
I could have expected. Thanks. No problem. Try not to die. All right. Reese, you all right? Nope. Good thing I got that tuking out of my system. Okay. Maybe we should step away. Reese, you can do it. Climbing with your cyber arm should be easy. Easy, right? Yeah. <laughs> Stupid, nice robot. Oh, you heard her. Climb. Climb. That is a. That is. That is nasty. That is bloody. That's what that is. Oh, God. Is that a call? You got some impeccable timing. Hey, I don't know when you gave me the slip, but Finch and Kroger are out there looking for you, and things are going to get messy if you start messing with us. Well... Don't forget what's on the line here. You get us what we <sighs> want, what we agreed to, and no one has to get hurt. Dude, I'm kind of in, in the middle. middle of something. I'm going to have to call you back. What? Listen to me, you... God, so dramatic about everything. We're going to make you pay. Ugh, dramatic. Go. Hey, radio. How are you doing today? <laughs> All right. Well, this looks nice. Hey, check you out. You made it. In the end, we make a pretty good team, huh? I mean, we had our differences, but we got here. You have a gold. Well, uh, our office now. It's you and me, Jack. I gotta say, Jack, I, I couldn't have made it here without you. Hey, same to you, man. Wow, I used to dream about being here. And now you're finally in here. Where's the Gordis Beacon? That's uh, gotta be over there somewhere. It's where all the corporate warfare fallout is. Ton of Atlas crap. Soak it in, kid. Enjoy yourself. All right, well, let's see what's in here. Hey, there's my man. What's on your mind? What's this office even for? So, what's the point of this office? I mean, from what I read, you spent most of your time running around Elpis or Pandora. Yeah, but it's always nice to have somewhere we can just kick back, put up your feet, vent some subordinates out in airlock. You know, it's like I always say, home is where your airlock collection of valuables is. Uh, does that desk do anything? Do anything cool? <laughs> yeah, you'll see. I mean, not in a, in a threatening, I'm gonna kill you way, but more like a, I'm gonna show you in a bit and it'll be awesome. Got it. Away. Oh. Cool. You build this office yourself? <laughs> Did I build it? No. No, 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 no. Jack doesn't do that. I think I'm just going to take a look around. That's the spirit. Okay. Stuff on desk. And what? Oh. Those picture. Who's this? Oh. Uh. Yeah. Angel. That's my angel. Don't usually like people knowing about her. <laughs> you and me are pretty tight. Once we're done with all this vault stuff, I'd like to check up on her. That's cool. What do you mean? Wait, what? She's dead. What? What do you mean? Check up on her? The f what is this? Ah, it's a piece from an early immortality She's dead. suit prototype, but it uh, killed the subject, which is great, but just not what we're going for. Angel not dead. Stuff at window. Hello. Okay. Okay, bye. No, Jack is fully aware that his daughter is dead. Jack's fully aware. It's not like a woo, didn't know that. Welcome to my trophy case. Huh? Got a couple of killer relics. Few artifacts. Oh, there's a stock certificate signifying that I own Atlas. That's pretty freaking cool. Nothing feels better than crushing a company's value to the point where you can buy all their shares with pocket change. 
delish. Gordas, you there? Hey! Uh, hi. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna show you the pieces now. You let me know which one it is. All right? Okie dokie. Okie dokie, Dan. Obviously that, but I'm gonna look at everything else. Oh, I'm so excited! Definitely not. Oh, this, this shotgun, it's legend freaking dairy. <laughs> Hyperion named it the conference call because you're gonna want to call everyone to tell them how awesome it is. <laughs> then you kill them. Oh, why well, you gotta kill them? Let's uh. Oh, we can't look at the gun. Nope, but cute cowboy hat. Cowgirl. Yeah, I don't uh, have a cowboy hat. Uh, that was my girlfriend's hat. Well, her first one before she became a sexy badass sheriff type chick. <laughs> he suited her. Oh, so uh, that's her hat. Alright, let's look at that. So this means. You own Atlas? Yep, that's right. I own the whole shebang. This way I've got the option of building them back up to destroy all over again whenever I want. Hey, so we can bring back Atlas weapons. Do that. Hurry up, Reed. You got I don't even know what that is. It's Yeah, yeah, yeah. a goatee. Yeah. <laughs> it belonged to the jackass Earl Tassiter, my former boss. I like to keep that around as a reminder of what happens when you act like a dick to me. Oh, nice. Okay, well, let's start looking at these objects. Nope. Nope. Okay. Okay. Hey, I know this is your office, but uh. This is my office now. Cool. I'm gonna paint it rainbow colors. Rainbows. Oh, it's obviously this little thing. Yeah, that's it. That's the one. Okay. The U-shaped thing with the little spear. Great. I'll be down there in a minute. Okay. See you soon. Okay. And now we just walk out with this? Not much to look at. Okay. Here we go. The big seat is all yours. You trigger the trap door from there. Uh... Oh, let's put, let's put the, our ass inside of the chair and press the button. Hey, was that gorgeous? Feels good. That'd be the contact activated dopamine injectors. You look like somebody who could kill a bunch of people with a phone call and a little bit of bass in your voice. So tell me how to trigger the trap door. It's behind your pinky. This could be our last chance to chat, you and I. For years, I ruled Hyperion. This feels like a and trap. And now you're here, where it all started. How's it feel, kiddo? There's something to be said for a cushy chair with a bunch of big important buttons that can raise hellfire on people it's good to be the king i knew there was a reason we got along so well kid you get it this doesn't feel right something don't feel right Say, about this we shared the power i had when i sat in this room what would you do with it what's going on here jake what the hell is taking him so long? Reese, the machine is off. Did you get the beacon? We're ready for you. All good. Just getting into position. Oh! Someone is here! Hey! Oh, you! Come back! Gordas, come back over here. Wow! You're all telling me to do the same thing! What are the odds of that? Um... Who's, who, who is this? I'm sure she'd like to see you, too. Oh, hey, here she is. 
Hello? Oh shit, it's Yvette. Hi. Oh. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's so, bad. If we could wield Hyperion's mic together, how would you rule? Hypothetical, of course. But still, you gotta know what you want if you're gonna make it, kid. Like I told you after we escaped Old Haven. Remember? It fixed Pandora. There's some good people down there. They deserve better than a world full of psychos. Yeah, that's what I wanted. But hell, maybe you'll pull it off. Who knows? You've done well so far, kid. But imagine, Reese, if it wasn't hypothetical. You ever wonder why Nakayama created me? This whole AI thing? I was supposed to find a worthy successor to the Hyperion throne. And that successor, Reese, is you. If uh, you join me, we can rule together. Seems like what such a say, bad kid? idea. This is the only room with the override port, so if you don't jack in now, you'll never get another shot. Say rule, no Hyperion. Rush, but, uh, <laughs> That's the only option. Yeah? yeah. Let's do it. Yes! You! You are my favorite dude! So what's next? There it is. That's the executive override port. Jack in, and this will all be yours. This feels Jack like in. such a trap. Big moment for us, kiddo. Been a long time coming. A lot of people had to die. Well, we find that. Let's do it. Pull it in. <laughs> Here it comes. Reese, the machine is off. Did you get the beacon? We're ready for you. All good. Just getting into position. You know, come to think of it, I'm glad you told her about me. It'll make it so much easier to appreciate her shocked face when she sees us sitting in the throne. So, is that it? Are we done? Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, man, it feels good to get out of there. Road trip's over, Reese. We made it. So, what happens now? Oh, you? You're getting a huge promotion, pal. And since I'm in the system now, allow me to do the honors. Uh. Hey, hey, friends. Remember me? It's your old pal, Jack. Well, pencils down, amigos. I've got someone to introduce you to. There's a new president in town. That's right, baby. Get those hands a clapping, because I want to give a very special Hyperion welcome to the cheekiest of executives. Totally president material. All the way from janitorial. This can't be happening. <laughs> Wait, so this is actually mine. This this is mine to control. Take it in, Reese. Hyperion, Pandora, Elpis. Oh, they are just the start. We'll rule this entire freaking universe. You and me, kiddo. President Reese and handsome hot damn Jack. So Jack is back. <laughs> and we're the president. Nice. All right. Well then. Okay then. That was interesting. <laughs> That was definitely an interesting playthrough and a, uh, yeah. Only 12% went with the Cowboy Bebop. 44% let the group get vaporized. 70% shot the innocent diamond pony. Only 25% only re revealed the uh, handsome Jack. Hey, 63% of people knocked Yvette out. 
Wow. Ruling Hyperion was the lesser chosen lesser chosen option. Well then, I gotta say, I enjoyed this. You know, round of applause for for Telltale for making this because this was probably my favorite episode thus far. And I hope you all enjoyed it. You know, I'm looking forward. The finale, they do five episodes, don't they? So the finale would be the next one, if I'm not mistaken. I I believe that the next one is the finale. I believe so. Yeah. I believe so. All right. Well. That was definitely fine. So let's let's talk, let's take a minute here. So we've got Handsome Jack and we've got he's ruling he's ruling Pandora now. Do they do they tease the next episode? Do they tease the next episode at all? Can we see that? Little little, little teaser? Little teaser? No, thank you. What do we got? Nope, no teaser for the next one. It's just That's just going to be it. That's just going to be the last one. The Vault of the Traveler. It's like Reese and Fiona are having a little bit of a thing here. We don't have anything to know about this. I'll be I'll be making some some videos discussing this before episode five comes out. Definitely. That was that would have been that would have been great. Poor Scooter Man. I guess that does that mean we're not gonna get Scooter in Borderlands three? That's gonna be that's gonna be interesting. Thank you for the five dollar donation, Noi Loot. Told you it would have been the best episode. Also, Team Jack, you've made the right decision. Well, thank you. Uh. I mean, who doesn't like who doesn't like Cowboy Bebop? Third floor, Tom. Who doesn't like it? No fall damage, man. He'll be perfectly fine. Yeah, but the explosion's gonna kill him. The explosion is gonna kill him. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right. 